Hello? What the f Holy crap. Oh, the carriage! The oh! Oh my god! This man was here taking a picture of his son in this mirror right here. This girl in the back, they have no idea who that is. She was not in that room at the time. This is a spirit. This is a entity that they call on camera in this mirror right here. Ah! What the f What the hell was that? Something is here. Yeah. Something is here right now. Yeah. And it's angry. Stabbed. 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 Dragged. Whoa. Buried. Where are you buried? Are you buried on the property? Yes. My body. Put those on screen. I'm not going to look at them. Ah! What the f What the hell is that? I can't f***ing do this anymore. I'm done. I'm done. Tonight, we are staying overnight in Vermont's most haunted house. This place is freaky, and it has a lot of dark history dating back to the early 1800s. At this point, there's nine known spirits, but a lot of unknown spirits. So we're hoping to see if we could figure out some of these unknown ones and the dark entities here as well. Also, as of lately, they've been finding out some information about some bodies that are buried on this property. So that's gonna be pretty damn interesting. So let me tell you guys something. We've already been here for a couple of hours and we've experienced some crazy, scary stuff that I can't wait to show you. But before we do, I just wanna introduce my friends. We got Angelo behind the camera. What's up guys? We got Chad at the top of the stairs. He's uh, gonna go investigate the second floor. So we're all gonna be doing our own videos. So go check out my friends' channels uh, down in the description below. Apart from that though, um, yeah, I do wanna mention something. We've been on this like haunted road trip recently, and I'm gonna be honest, Angelo, I truly feel as if from the last location we filmed at, something may have followed us back. Like a dark presence may have followed us back. And even when I'm alone, even when I'm just doing anything, I feel as if there's always something there with me. And I know you mentioned something about it too. Yeah, yeah. Weird there's things. definitely some weird stuff going on. So just, just get ready guys and um, I heard something. Chad? You don't hear that? No. Well, I was gonna I say. Been, I don't know. Who before been, Chad. Well, I was gonna say. With all that being said, guys, if you are enjoying these videos and you want to see more, make sure to leave a like on this video. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, make sure to do that because we're on the road to 500,000 subscribers, and I can only get there with your support. And um. Yeah, get ready for a crazy night here at the Wilson Castle. Um, as a matter of fact, I want to show you some of the stuff here because this place is actually like horrifying. Let me show you this room over here. This is probably the perfect room to do like a seance in, I'm thinking. And this is all the original stuff. We're talking like hundreds of years worth of stuff in this room. And I mean, just the entire place. However, the second floor is the haunted floor. That is the hot spot for paranormal. And that's mm -hmm. where we're really gonna be spending the majority of our night and sleeping in as well, so. Yeah. What do you think, Angela? Uh, I have a lot of experiences in this house and uh, I think it's gonna be a pretty uh, So you were telling experience. me the last time you guys were here, you literally caught something, like someone moving yeah. the curtains. Yeah, so um, that was the first, I've been here twice. So the first time that I was here, um, essentially, that one night in particular, Chad has footage of, he was filming the front of the house, it was actually a B-roll shot, and you can f visibly see an arm open and close the curtains. And like I said, there was two other people, I had already left, I was on my way down to Florida at the time, and uh, the other two people were sleeping all the way in the opposite side, and he asked them, he's like, did you guys come and look out the window? And they're like, no, we were sleeping. Like, why would we do that? It was right, six o'clock right. in the morning, right? So. Yeah, all sorts of crazy stuff, so. Um, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna put that on screen for you guys because that's absolutely insane. Yeah. We're gonna be investigating this house a little bit differently because this place is so damn massive and we really only have one night to film here. We're gonna be doing a lot of splitting up. There's three floors and a basement. So get ready for a lot of footage and. And there's an attic. And an attic. All righty, you know I love my attics. So, I heard, what the fuck is that? Private. We're not even supposed to be in here. 
These are the stairs to the attic, right? Yeah. So there's like the water dripping here, but there was, I heard something else. Hello? Chad? No, he's way upstairs. Yeah, he's probably on that side. All right. Um, well, I'm gonna go get the rest of my equipment and we're gonna start investigating some more. So see you guys in a little bit. Peace. I just wanna put a quick warning, guys. This is one of, if not the most active locations I have ever been to. I will scream, I will swear, I will run for my life. So just be prepared. I don't know what the hell is going on in this place and I don't know why I thought it'd be a great idea to split up right away. However, my friends were outside while I was inside and shit hit the fan. I was scared for my life. All right, guys, so like I said earlier, we are going to be starting this video very differently. I've somehow convinced the guys, actually, they were very willing to do this, <laughs> to let me go and investigate the entire house by myself first, because they've already been here. It's my first time, so thanks, guys. No and problem. You're welcome. Bro, I swear to God, I swear to God, I just saw some, like something standing in that middle window right there. Look, it's moving. The drapes are moving. Oh, yeah. I really hope you guys can see this. The drapes are literally moving. What room is that? That's uh, Sarah's room. Yeah, that's the one with the portal. End of vortex, apparently. Whatever ah. that means. All right. Well, um, I'm going to go in here, guys. Uh, wish me luck. Oh, I wanted to talk about one thing, actually, before I go inside. So while I'm in here, they're going to go investigate the haunted forest that's in the back. And... This is really freaky because Chad went back there and he found an entire satanic ritual with like skulls of God knows what animal or whatever it was, just tons of them laid out. Man, I can show you the skull if you want. I have it here. You have a skull? Yeah, I brought it with me. Did anybody else just hear that? What'd you hear? There was something walking back there. Oh, hell, that's your guy's problem. My problem's inside. <laughs> but the, this crazy thing is, when he was there at 2 o'clock in the morning, he heard a little girl scream from the forest. Why would a little girl be screaming in a forest? So, come to find out, you dig a little bit deeper into the history here, a, one of the neighbors nearby saw a girl by the name of Angel running down the street, covered in blood, screaming for her life. They reported to the police, but nobody was ever able to find her after that. No one knows what happened to her. However, it is known that there's a lot of bodies buried on this property and in the forest behind this place. So, you know, you always got to wonder. But regardless, guys, I'll keep sharing some more information throughout the night as I'm investigating. But uh, all right, guys, good luck. I'm, good luck to me, I guess. <laughs> and you guys for whatever the hell you just... All right. <laughs> yeah, good luck. Oh, my gosh, these doors. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it right now. <laughs> mm. The damn night scared the hell out of me. <laughs> I knew that's not what it was. Damn it, man. Alright. Alright. All right. You stay the right there. <laughs> um, alrighty. Where do I even begin? So I want to reiterate, there is a lot in this place, a lot of um, items, haunted items, a lot of history here. So just keep that in mind when. Is there anybody here with me right now? Can you please come forward and make yourself known? I'm actually going to be firing up some devices of my own right here. So I'll be running Spirit Talker and Necrometer. All right. If there's anybody, that is what I'm using, my ghost box, correct. Um, all right, well, that was quick. Sophia. Sophia. All right, Sophia, a pleasure to meet you. My name is Jazz Yasko. Um, I'd like to get to know you a little bit better. And uh, if you want to share right your foot. right foot, what in the world does that mean? If you're here, please come forward, make yourself known. Medium. Medium. Okay. I'm going to leave these right here. 
Spirits, I have two devices right here. If you could use your energy to speak to me, communicate with me through these two devices right here, or if you can give me a sign to let me know you're here, like a sound or anything, I would very much appreciate it. Uh, maybe you could play one of these pianos or, I think that's an organ, right? I have no idea. Um, actually, I'm not gonna touch that. This is all probably very expensive stuff. God forbid something gets pushed or knocked over and breaks. I will probably be in debt for the next very long time. So I will say though, spirits, these are probably your pianos and organs and all the sorts. So if there's anything here with me right now, can you please make yourself known by playing this piano right here? What the? F what even is this? Okay. Ah, shit, the piano! Holy sh! Thank you! Thank you very much! Oh my gosh, okay. I'm gonna bring these devices with me. Return. All right, I will return the devices. <laughs> they will stay right there. Um, as for me, let's see what's over here. Is there anybody over here in this room? Overdose. Overdose. Oh, shit. Wow. This is so freaky, but so cool because, I don't know. What was that? What the hell was that? Who's there? Bro, what the hell is going on? Hello? Oh, what the fuck was that? Bro, a flash just went off. I don't know if you guys saw that because this is night vision, but a light just went off. Like it flickered or something. I really hope the camera caught that. All this said was over to, oh no, Spear Talker said Maria, but it stopped. Why did it stop? Bro, something is messing with the equipment right now. My phone's already acting up and I swear to you, the light just flickered. I really hope it caught that. Who just messed with the equipment in here? Roger. Roger. All right, Roger. Sounds good. Um, thank you for... Go here. Where do you want me to go? Right there. What the hell was that? Diana. Oh my God, Diana. I said, what the hell was there? Okay. You got it, Diana. I'm coming. Soul. One lost soul. Okay. Uh, I'm coming, Diana. I got chills right now. Where? Take some pictures. Oh, take some pic. Di it says that Diana's in here. Wants me to take some pictures. I can do that. I can do that. Okay. <sighs> okay. Here we go. I'm gonna do some night shot photos right now. I'll make sure to put these on screen for you guys. Take some flash photos as well. Okay. I'll put those on screen. I'm not gonna look at them. Ah! What the f What the hell is that? Bro, my heart. My f right now. Ah, what the hell is that? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hello? We do not. We. Bro, I'm freaking out right now. I don't even know what to do. Amanda. Amanda, okay, Amanda, I hear you loud and clear. That clock is ticking so loud right now. Night. Night. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna put these down right here. 
She haunts. He died. She haunts. He died. Okay. That's... That's the f***ing piano. I really hope to God this mic is picking. That was the piano. Loud and clear. Who's over there? Bro, this is freaking me out right now. I'm sorry for screaming, brother. I'm so sorry. They're, they're probably, actually, they're probably in the forest right now. They probably can't even hear me out here. Who's over there playing the piano? Huh? What did that say? Who? This is freaking me out. Divisors. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm going to... Paul? Yep, that was Paul. Alrighty, well, I am going to head upstairs. Um, first floor. Thank you for... Too many. Too many spirits. I said, who was that over there? Paul? Then I said, too many. Okay. Um, I'm going to head upstairs now. Everything that I just experienced in the last 10 minutes on the first floor doesn't even compare to what I'm about to experience on the second floor. The second floor is where all the hauntings are at. That's where all the dark entities are at. And uh, all I'm going to say is it only gets crazier from here. Take a look. All right, guys, so here I go upstairs. I'm gonna go investigate the second floor and um, see if I can figure out. Keep in mind, this is the most haunted floor in this building. So I'm gonna try to mentally prepare myself. The light's on up here, so that makes it less scary. Uh, we got pianos in literally every corner and um, make sure my spirit talkers are working. Is there anybody here with me on the second floor? Play some pool. So. Remember the entity that I told you about named Dick? Open window. Oh, open window. Oh my God, that makes a lot of sense because if I saw the curtain moving, it could be as simple as an open window. That makes a lot of sense. I was gonna say uh, the, the Dick that I talked, the man Dick. <laughs> oh my God, I, there's no way to say this. The man named Dick <laughs> that I talked about earlier. Um, it's not funny. He died right here. So he died on this couch right here. Well, I... Don't talk. Don't talk. As Battle. I just hear something over here. Hello? Who's in here? Oh, shit. Oh, that dress scared the living shit out of me. Oh, my God. Dude, this dress scared the bejesus out of me. Hello? Oh, yeah, so I think, yep, this is the haunted mirror. Sure, okay. This is the haunted mirror, and if you look right here, there are photos that I'll show you. Actually, I'll put them on screen for you right here of things that guests have caught. And this is the craziest thing ever. They literally took a picture of this child, but there was another child in the back looking out the window. Oh, and as a matter of fact, I do believe that that's the window right here. So you know what I'm gonna say? I'm gonna have a seat, try to communicate with the Spirit, this is Sarah's room. Sick. Sick. Sarah, were you sick? It's just freaky to me, the whole um, open window thing. But, Sarah, are you here with me right now? 17. 17. Were you 17 years of age when you passed? Sarah. Oh! Oh my God! I... Thank you. I'm sorry, I got a little excited there. Thank you so much for communicating with me, Sarah. Thank you for acknowledging that. Wow! I got chills. <laughs> um... I'm like a kid in a candy store right now. Sarah, if you're here with me right now, can you give me a sign to let me know you're here? It's 
So I believe that they said that that closet right there is the portal. So you said that the, it was an open window, right? Actually, you know what? I feel like me and Sarah are starting off on a good note. 1970s. I feel like me and Sarah are starting off on a good note, so I would like to probably sleep in here if I can. Um, but I do want to check these windows because if there is an open... Oh. The window's closed. Every single window. Holy shit! Wait a second. If every single window is closed in this... How the hell? Not only did they... Shot. Shot? Okay. Is that what happened to you? Bro. Yo. Okay. Um. And I just want to reiterate. That girl that you saw in the photo, they believe that that's Sarah because that black dress that was in that photo, you can actually see that dress in one of these rooms over here. I'm gonna go show you that. So Sarah, thank you again. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm gonna go continue exploring. Sarah, if you wanna continue to show yourself the remainder of the night, uh, if you wanna get more. Black veil. And if, if I remember correctly, it was a black dress. So, girl, okay. Is there another girl here with me right now? Do you want to play some pool maybe? Watching. Watching. Where are you watching me from? Bro, I really hope you guys can see this picture. This small ass baby is carrying David. David. Is that David? Wow. This small ass baby is carrying around some heavy ass golf clubs. Someone, someone test that baby. Oh, Lisa Monin. Scratched. Scratched. Oh, hell no. Oh, hell no. Please do not scratch me. Not tonight, please. I'm with family. Death. I'm with family. Death. Okay. Um, let me take a look at this room. I gotta put this down right here. Altar. Altar. Is this room an altar? Oh, wow. A lot of... A very, very kid kind of room. Oh, look at this little baby. Look at the baby. Is there anybody here with me? Move east. Move east. Brother, I don't know what it is about this room, but it's giving me the heebies. What the f Hello? Bro, it literally sounded like something was on the stairs. Negative. Negative. Okay, are you in this room? Can you give me a sign and let me know you're here? Ah, the carriage, the, oh, oh my God. What is going on in this house, bro? What is going on in this house? Thank you. I'm sorry, I'm freaking out. I gotta check out this. Maple. Okay, listen guys, I'm just freaking out. Oh, Bro, there's something over in that corner. Something is in there. Which uh, direction is this place? Oh, it's so wet. Down that way? Oh, so wet. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, man. Chad. I think I just heard something. What the hell was that? 
fuck's that? Oh, I'm freaking the fuck out. Okay. <sighs> Hello, is anybody in here? Oh, oh, oh my god, I saw the dress in the mirror. They have to stop doing that. I forgot my phone's over there. They have to stop putting dresses in random little corridors. It scares the shit out of me every time. Hello? Yo! What happened? What happened? Why? What happened? Well, we went towards the forest and we heard the loudest scream ever. You hear that? What the fuck is that? Uh -huh. Oh, you guys probably can't even hear. So Jesus, um, you probably, guys probably can't even hear. They just said they heard the loudest scream outside. I didn't hear anything. It was coming from the forest? Bro, I'm getting the craziest responses right now. Yeah. It is insane. And I was in Sarah's room, Spearbox said, Sarah, it was insane. Uh, did say Sarah? In Sarah's room. Oh my God. While I was like, Sarah, are you here? It was like, Sarah. Yeah. Oh my God, man. Um, Let's just say Sarah again. Bro, I'm gonna go check. All right, I think we should maybe stick together then. Maybe nobody goes outside. Is it still raining? Uh, not really. I'm gonna stick to the castle. What did it say? Bro, hold on. I want to tell you guys something. This carriage thing moved. On God, this thing moved. This thing literally moved, Angelo. It literally like moved forward. Ooh. And it does not make sense. Where was it? Like right back here. And and it just like moved forward towards me. Okay. Yo, what's that room behind you? Um, three spirits. I can't really see. Bro, you... Three spirits? I said, what's that room behind you? Three spirits. Um, here, I'll check then. I see that there's a picture like... Yeah. Okay. What's in there? Um... A bathtub? No, it's a... What the hell? Oh, that's a weird smell in here. Oh, it is weird. Oh my god. What is that? Uh... Angelo, I, I don't know. Are we supposed to be in here? Um... Probably... I don't know. I... I don't know. <laughs> I've never even seen this room before. Right? And you guys have been here yeah, many times. I've never like stopped the camera. Whoa. I feel really weird. Were we not supposed to find this room? I don't know. Do you feel weird in here? Dude, it's bad smell. Right? Freezing cold. It smells like death in here. Uh, Chad. <laughs> it smells like death in here, he said. Um, yo, I have an idea. Why don't we find out what happened in here? I think the smell's coming from Let's do an Estes method in here. Okay. What is that though? I, I, I don't know and I almost don't want to find out. I kind of want to find out. Alright, touch it. That's not what I meant. Okay, so the thing is, is we know that there's things in here that was used to transport bodies hundreds of times. There are things in here that have passed from, from literal dead people that we're just pushed places, hidden places, and I don't want to be that guy, but you know what I mean. I'm getting a really weird vibe. I think we should do an Estes method in this room. If we want to find out some answers, it said three spirits and stop the camera. So God knows, but maybe we could figure out some more information with that. Yeah. Um, but all right, let me go get my main camera and let's, let's do that. Listen guys, I really need your help here. So I'm about to do this Estes method in this abandoned bathroom thing that kind of looks like it was sealed away or hidden for whatever reason, I don't know. But Angelo and Chad are about to ask me some questions and I'm gonna answer them to my best ability with the headphones on connected to the spear box. 
If you make any correlations that I may have missed or anything of the sorts, please comment down in the comment section below and inform us because we would really love to know. And thank you so much in advance, but uh, take a look at this because this is the craziest Estes method I have ever done by far. All right, guys, uh, I'm here in this room blindfolded and can't hear anything. So uh, I'm gonna be doing the Estes method uh, and they're gonna be asking me questions from the other room. So I have this camera over here as well, recording, and um, hopefully we're able to figure out some of the secrets about this room and maybe we'll just, whoever's willing to communicate with us, it doesn't matter who it is, I'm just trying to communicate to someone. So I already told Angelo and Chad to ask questions and not let me know what type of questions they're gonna be, kind of just surprise me. And um, oh, can one of you just press the start button on the phone? I can't see sure. shit. Sure. Ah, Alrighty. so loud. Cool. All right, thank you. Did you bring it? I did bring it. Bye. Sick. So there's a, we have a skull of something. We'll explain in a second what Bones. this is. What the hell? Oh, she's already going. Dude, he literally just said bones. Oh, that's right? a bone. Yeah. Surprise. Uh, yeah, it is a surprise. I just don't want him to realize it. Okay. Kill him. Angel. Oh, shit. Okay. That's the creepiest sound ever. Um, Sacrifice. Yeah, so there's a bit of a uh, story behind that skull. So Chad went into the forest, like, what, a year and a half ago or something like that? Help me. And, and you found, like, what, 12 help me. skulls in the forest? He's saying, help me. 12 skulls in the forest. And they all had like gunshots running in the head. They have bullet holes in Yeah, them. we don't know what they are. Help it's me. Some kind of animal, most likely, but it's really creepy. So we're gonna ask some questions pertaining to that. Alrighty. Um, can somebody give us some answers as to what the deal is with the bones in the forest? Well, it's weird that he said Sacrifice. Angel. Yeah, it is weird that he said because Angel. Of the girl's voice that I caught in the woods. Yeah. What are those bones exactly? Secrets. What animal is that? Don't tell anybody. Close this a little more. What animal are those bones? Can you tell us? Animal. We know it's an animal. What kind of animal? Doesn't matter. It worked. Ha! Ah, shit! Uh -oh. the, hell? the screams in my ear get me every time. Every single time. It'll be dead quiet and out of nowhere just, ah! And it gets me every time. Who's screaming in there? Angel. Oh running, Ooh. running. Holy shit. Oh, that's really weird. Or it literally sounds like someone's out of breath in my ear right now, like actually running. I don't remember. I don't know either. Two of them. Why are you running, Angel? Them. Who are they? Did they hurt you? They saw me. They saw her. They saw you do what? Running. Who's... Who saw you? Oh my God. I'm getting like two separate groups. It almost sounds like one is trying to tell me something and the what others are like trying to like cancel out the story. And it's like, it was like running. No, she wasn't. It was so weird. So why are you running, Angel? Help me. Oh my God. That was... It's like someone whispered, help me in my ear. Are you in danger? Did you do something wrong? It's too late. It's too late for what? I'm dead. Who killed you? Stabbed. Stab. Dragged. Whoa. Buried. Where are you buried? Are you buried on the property? Yes. My body. Where is it exactly? 
behind. Behind what? Back door, window, forest. What the fuck? Back door. It just keeps saying. Are you, what was that building back there? You said there was like a gas house or something? It's a gas house. Are you at the gas house or are you behind the castle? Tell us one for gas house, two for castle, or three deep in the forest. It's like dead quiet right now. What the? Leave. Why were they after you? What did you do? They are here. Who are they? One. 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 So at the gas house? One. Who, why? They keep saying one in my ears. One what? Leave. Well, I did, I just did say one for the gas house, so I'm assuming that's what they're talking about. Oh, yeah. Is it just me or did that door just open a little bit? Oh! Damn, that sounded so weird. I'm hearing so many voices, but there's this one particular woman's voice and it sounds like she's in so much distress and she just pops out of nowhere. It's almost like she's trying to vividly show me, like like paint a picture in my head of like what happened to her. Ah, stop that shit, please, Jesus. Ah, golly. He's here, okay. Bro, I am so shaken up right now. I got goosebumps everywhere. He sees you. Who sees who? Me or Jazz? Everyone. He sees you. Is he in the room? Or is he in the bathroom? And Did we open this? I'm done. What the f is really? <laughs> Yo. Oh my god, man. That was creepy as all hell. Dude, it literally like just felt like it felt like someone went like this on the back of my neck, just like that. Oh. Like cold, cold, but it felt like I don't know. Gosh. Is there like a mark on there? Let me see. I hope not. No. Almost looks like a little bit. Please tell me no. I don't see anything. I don't know. Thank well, God. There's like one line there, but I don't know. <sighs> really? Damn. <laughs> I mean. <laughs> what is that about? We had to find out some answers about what the hell this thing was all about. And, uh. Let me tell you, we got some answers. We got some answers about this angel, apparently. So we do think she's buried. There's there's a oh gas house. Oh my god. I kept hearing angel, but for some in my yeah. head I was clicking like like an angel you know, angel, like yeah. an actual Yeah. They don't do that, but you know angel. <laughs> do that again. What, well, is, what no, is an I'm angel to Jazz? I'm not, I'm not, no, I'm not doing that again. <laughs> um, um so I asked uh one, if they were buried at the gas house. Two, at the castle. Is there just a loud uh, bang behind us? I thought I heard like a door slam or something. It said at the back. Back door, window. And there's... Bro, it was weird. It, it didn't stop there though. And I just, I couldn't catch up. It yeah. was like back, door, window, forest, trees. And right. then they started saying like six, seven feet. This, that. It was like almost yeah. describing like... It was weird. It was Dude, so weird. There's, there's a gas house at the back of the forest. A gas house? Yeah. That's why 
I think that's why it kept saying number one, because I said, give me number one if you're buried at the gas house, and it kept saying one. Excuse my ignorance, what's a gas house? I don't know. What is a gas house? <laughs> it's, well, it's just, I don't even know. It's like a, a, a little gas house thing that's in the woods. Uh, it's like a tiny little house. Oh, sorry. Yeah, so it's a house. I don't house, even know what it's used for. To be it's a honest. house made of gas. Fair enough, okay. Um, you said the questions were answered pretty... Pretty well, I'd say. Yeah, I think. I, I just wonder what this room was for, because you can tell that this room is... Dude, that's original, original. Oh, yeah. Like, however, you can definitely tell that the walls here, especially, are just decaying to shit. Mm -hmm. This is actually, bo I just realized that's boarded. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. Um, okay, um, I'm ready to go. All right, well. <laughs> Skull? I'll pass, Skull? I'll pass this time around, <laughs> Angel. Skull? Oh, give it back to me, yeah. There you go. <laughs> I'll take it. That thing is creepy. This thing is so creepy. Dude, like, look look at that. There's literally, like, either it got stabbed by something, like with a tool, or Jeez. it's a bullet. What the hell did I just That's say? Weird. Day it didn't go off the whole time. <laughs> I just turned it on. Oh. Uh, um, yeah. This is what we found in the woods. And that was part of the, like, say, 10. Oh, my God. Earlier when I was filming, I said altar. When I entered this room, I said altar. Really? You think well, that this thing was in there? Well, no, no, no. Earlier, when I told you the carriage moved and shit, yeah. it uh, said altar. So, so I'm, you, I'm wondering if maybe this room has some sort of significance to that. Oh, maybe. You never know. So you said there was twelve of those? Wow. Well, I mean, did you ever like take at least. I mean, it might have been like, you know, eight or ten. I mean, there was a number of them. Yeah. There was a good amount. And I love how your course of action was, I'm going to take this home with me and then put oh, it in the same room I mean, yeah, it's an, art, it's an <laughs> artifact. <Yeah. laughs> no, I mean, I, hey, listen. This goes in the relics <laughs> case at home. All right. I just saw something really weird. What'd you say? I just saw this white thing go literally right ah! the, the door! The door! What? 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 Was it moving? I swear on everything, something was... Certain something was just standing right. I swear to you, guy. I know you. What did I say about the attachment, Angelo? Something followed oh, us here. Yeah, I think. I, I think I agree with you on that one. Fuck, man! I swear to you, there was something standing in the doorway, like full, like a black mass just yeah, standing there. Wouldn't put it past you. They see shadows here all the time now. He said he's been seeing them a lot yeah. recently. Andy, Andy said that. I, I mentioned earlier that there's a lot of haunted items here. Mm -hmm. uh, and so, for example, this eight ball right here, someone took this. Yeah. They, they borrowed it, right? And they actually returned it because it was too haunted. And this note right here is the original note. It says on the note, to whom this may concern, I am returning this eight ball to you. It was borrowed from the Wilson Castle pool table. My apologies for any inconvenience this may have caused you. It belongs to the rightful owner, sincerely anonymous. Yeah. Literally, someone was too freaked out after they... <sighs> yeah, because they say that anything that's uh, taken, taken from, from the castle tends to be haunted. And, uh, yeah. So, and there's also this skull and bones. Is that real? I don't know. I think it is. I, there's a tooth. There. Yeah, it has to be. It has like something written on it. Guys? Yeah. What? Did you just hear that? It wasn't you? I'm standing right here. It came from in here, 100%. Oh. Oh. That voice is so creepy. I'm it is creepy as shit. <laughs> is there anybody in here with me? Hold on. I'm gonna take some photos quick. There. So Guys, I just, I think I might have just seen the same thing you guys just saw. What the hell was that? Did you guys hear that? What happened? There was I'm like sorry. a... I'm taking photos, I'm sorry. There was a noise, I think it was there. In Sarah's room? I think so, yeah. I saw something, it looked like... Let me go grab my phone quick. Sort of like a figure.
Sarah, is that you or is that somebody else? Spiritus. Spiritus. It's coming from one of these rooms. Yeah. It's like a tapping, right? Yeah, constant tapping. All right, give us a sign to let us know what room you want us to go into. Holy shit. There's a lot of sounds in this place. It's very, very, I mean, we're on the second floor. They say the second floor is the most haunted. Okay. You guys heard that, right? It's not like something was literally being dragged. Yeah. Yes, I heard that. We heard that earlier, too. Yes, in that room as well. Yeah. It's in that room. This room? Yes, it's coming from that room, 100%. Who's in there? Let's go check it out. It's not like a weird, like a s or yeah. something. Yeah, right? that's literally what it sounds like. Sarah? Is there like a snake? Ah! Holy shit! Man. Okay. I'm gonna lose my mind over. I'm gonna lose my mind. Who was that? I'm not free. I'm not free. Are, are you trapped here? I'm curious. We were here earlier for Angelo's channel and this dress right here was moving. We caught it on camera moving. Sarah, are you here with us? I can't believe I was sitting right here and the spear box said Sarah to me. I. I I jumped, I literally jumped off the ground. Yeah. <laughs> How excited I was. That's freaking crazy. <laughs> so, I just wanna show you guys really quick. Jesus. This photo right here, this guy was taking a picture of his son. Mm -hmm. This right here, they have no idea who that is. Yeah. That was not, whatever that is, was not in this room. That is an anomaly. That is a spirit, an entity. And that is the most clear as day thing I have ever seen. Yeah, so that was taken literally right in front of this right mirror. Right in front of this mirror. And they have a dress that's almost exactly the same that belongs to The black to one. Sarah. It's, it's yeah. literally identical. Yeah. So they don't know if that was Sarah that they saw. They no, don't they know. have no idea. They have no idea. But I mean, if it was in Sarah's dress, that makes mm -hmm. a lot of sense. However, the other this thing. was another picture that they took in here. And if you look right there, there's another child. There's literal socks that you can see. They're even reflecting off of the hardwood floor. Yeah, it's uh, weird. <sighs> Why don't I try something? I'm gonna try taking a photo here. Chad, are you okay? Chad? Chad, you good? Uh, yeah, man. I just had to leave that room. Why? I don't know. Doesn't feel good being in there right now. Really? Just checking these photos quick. Angel, stay right there. Just so the light isn't like coming too much into the frame. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm gonna take some photos right here. Sarah, show yourself. Three rocks had children around you. There is there is a child 
What the f***? The entire mirror just shook. Yeah. And there is a child known to be here too. And in that photo, clearly. Yeah. yeah. And then the mirror... Sh yeah, what? His, his name is Elliot. Elliot? Yeah. Elliot, you here with us, pal? Can you show yourself in this mirror? I'll take a photo. Selfie time. You never know, bro. Maybe, uh... Angelo, that doesn't even make sense. Hold on, can we just clarify? There's nothing behind this fucking thing. Like, it, it moves a little bit yeah. when you walk. Dude, I'm so freaked out. And you know what's the crazy thing, Angelo? Hmm. Crazy thing of all, we haven't even went upstairs yet. I know. And on the third floor, there are entities up there. There is a haunted, another haunted item up there that we're going to be investigating as well. Sentient. It's, well, I don't know why it's not even saying the words out right now. What does sentient mean? Um, I don't quite remember. All right, let me know down in the comment section. <laughs> um, but let me go get another battery, get another flashlight, make sure Chad's okay, and then we're going to head up there. All yeah, right? cool. It seems that whatever affected Chad is now affecting me because I felt so drained. I was feeling weak, and I was like, all right, I need to go outside and take a break myself. So I met up with Chad, and I was like, hey, Chad, you doing all right? He was... Truth be told, he wasn't doing all right. He was looking pale in the face. He was sweating, even though it was cold outside and raining. And I was like, all right, well, are you ready for the third floor? If you're not, it's okay. He said he needs a little bit of time. I was like, all right, Angelo, let's go back to the second floor and continue investigating a little bit until he's ready. And uh, I'm very glad I did because what we just captured on camera, I can't even put into words. Just take a look. This location does not slow down in terms of activity. It is constantly ramping up and constantly getting, it's crazy. And as you saw, we were just in Sarah's room and it was nuts. Chad was definitely being affected by something and he had to go outside and get some fresh air. We're gonna continue to explore this floor because this floor is the haunted floor. We're trying to figure out what that was in that photo, who it was, because a lot of people speculate that it was Sarah and that's probably the most accurate, you know, I, hypothesis. Yeah. However, Uncertain. Uncertain. <laughs> <laughs> All righty. Well, listen, whoever is in Sarah's room, if you're still in here, can you give us a sign to let us know you're still here? Whoa. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Now we just need a name. I mean, it's told me Sarah earlier. I'm just going to yeah. assume it's Sarah. But. Oh. Someone's on this bed. I was supposed to sleep here. Do you want me to come sleep? Can he use your bed? The whole thing with the curtains, everything about this place is. Whoa. Oh what my. What the hell? Thank you. You said the curtains and the thing just went yeah, nuts. Yeah, to blue. Yeah. Hasn't done that yet. Okay, I think we're maybe getting closer and closer to... Um, do you have a question? I can't think of one right now. Um, I'm shooting blanks right now. At the moment. Ooh. All right, let's go see. I have an idea. Is the spirit of 1950s. 1950s. We're getting a lot of years yeah. throughout the night. Is the spirit of the girl in this photo here with us right now? Can you give us a sign to let us know that they are here at this moment? What the fuck is that? I don't know. It came from that room. That was like a confirmation. Yeah. Does that mean that you're in that room? Who's in there? Hello? <laughs> what the fuck? Holy crap. Look at that. Did you hear the spirit? That just like laughed. Yeah. What is going on in here? 
Bro, I'm gonna be honest. Something is here. Yeah. Something is here right now. Yeah. And it's angry. I'm gonna reset this quick. As a matter of fact, listen, we know you're here. Yeah. We know you're here. Okay. Bro, I fell on my wrist. Ah! Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. I mean, we know you're injury prone, so. I am. <laughs> <laughs> Let's not break anything. What the hell was that, though? I have an idea. What? Let's go from like left. Yeah. Right. What the hell was that? The f ball? It, it's missing a ball. Yeah. Bro, I'm freaking out right now. Who's doing this? Say yes. Huh? What? It says, say yes? Yes? <laughs> yes to what? Say yes to the dress. The TV I show. I mean, okay. No, I'm kidding. I have no idea. Was... Anybody in here? Is this stuck? Jeez. Ow. Oh, well, there goes your shoulder now, too. Yeah. Oh, shit. This room is creepy as all hell. Oh, my God. Hey, uh. Look at this. Mm. What the the vault's open. Ooh. Is this supposed to be open? I don't know. That's really cool. Where the money at? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> no, I'm playing. Any jewelry? No, nothing. Literally nothing in there. Is there anybody here? Angela, what the fuck is going on, man? I do not know. You want to go check? I'm kind of like frozen right now. Uh, I'm not going to lie to you. I mean, I'll go. I can. Did it say wait and see? Yep, it did. Wait and see what? Wait and see what? Yo, Angelo, look yeah. at this. Look right behind you. Okay. Is that the original, like... Looks like it. Angelo, 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 Angelo. What? I just saw something standing right there in that door. What did, what did you see? What did you see? Like a black mass, bro. Hold on, what did that say? I don't know. Ah, my damn shoulder. This would scare you. Wow. All right, well now they're just fucking with us. All right, I gotta go see what the hell <gasps> I just saw. All right, who was that? What was that? Location. Uh, Haunted Wilson Castle? Proctor Vermont. Bro, there's a weird vibe in this room. Oh my gosh. What in the actual hell is that? Bro, there's nothing in here. There is nothing in here. Obviousness. Obviousness. Hey, there is nothing here. This doesn't make sense. Not in the slightest. Something may make sense, though. Yeah. Sarah, I know that's your dress. Are you here with us right now? Are you the one making all this noise? Because let me tell you something. This is absolutely insane. I'm just popping in real quick to say if you are enjoying this video, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. I also want to ask a very quick question. So barring that we are about an hour into the video, I know that the people who are watching this far in are probably the more committed crowd. So I would really love to hear from you down in the comment section below. Do you prefer videos this long or longer? Or do you prefer the shorter videos? That's it. That's all I want to know. If you could let me know down in the comment section below, I'd love to know. And that's why I'm asking the people who are actually watching this far in because yeah, I could then change some things around. All right, well, whatever. Get back to the video. Sarah, I know this is your dress right here. Can you give me a sign to let me know that you're here, Sarah?
Oh, it's a morning dress. Not so. What? Not so. What's not so? Probably that sh she's not here. Oh, do you feel that cold breeze coming through? It's coming from this. Bro, there's yeah. something about this room right here. Yo, Angela, I'm going to do something a little weird. What's that? I'm going to step out of my comfort zone really quick. I'm going to take a bath. I heard something. You're going to take a bath? Hear me okay, out. Okay, well, if you're going to take a bath, oh, I'm going to pick a number between one and two. Sometimes three. Well, listen, there's something in this room. There's something on this floor. Let's be real here. So I'm going to see if maybe we can get some answers. You heard that, right? Mm -hmm. Chaser. Chaser? There's a dark entity on this floor, this second floor. Does this entity have a name? Bro, it's like tapping. I know, I can hear it. I'm mm -hmm. genuinely just concerned, Angela. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Demon. Oh, that's good. It's like reading your mind. Because I was going to say. Right. I kind of figured you were going there. I was worried that something's followed us yeah. here. Because we know that the, the second floor is haunted. But, bro, I'm genuinely concerned that this thing that's following us is, is like feeding off of us. And we're just going to these haunted locations and just getting like, you know. Yep. Agreed. Feel you, man. Is there something following us? Can you give us a sign to let us know that there's something following us? Or can you give us a... S protect yourself. Um, protect yourself. All right. Well, that's not a sign. Mm -hmm. Do you want to hurt us? Anything at all. Or how about this? If this entity that we're speaking to right now is from the Wilson Castle, can you give us a sign? Right over there. You hear that? That's the REM pod. Yeah, so something's back on Sarah's bed again. Yeah. Wait, we didn't... We turned the REM pod off. We did, yeah. No! Yes, we did. Yes, we did. We did, yeah. Okay. What the all hell is going on? Probably not. Probably not. Probably not? Angelo? Yeah. What is that? Uh, come here for a sec, bro. Uh, all the lights are off. Wait, that doesn't make any sense. Exactly. It doesn't make any sense. Hello? Is this demon doing this? Can you confirm for us? Do you want to go fuck yourself, demon? If it's Sarah, you're cool. What? There's something in this room. There is something in this room. I keep hearing things from here. Okay. There's something dark here. Whoa. Okay. Show yourself. There's something dark here, huh? Definitely. Definitely. I am freaking out. I'm gonna be honest, I am freaking out. Can you show yourself? 
Can you make that REM pod go off for us? You were making it go crazy earlier. Oh my god! What the hell? Oh. Okay. I'm gonna pass the f out. Angelo. Yes? Please tell me we turned that off. I swear I saw, unless I'm losing my mind. Unless, uh, did, did I, I'm, I, cause I'm, here's the thing. I'm thinking to myself, did I say I'm gonna reset it? Or did I say I'm gonna turn it off? Cause I think I said no, reset. I could swear, I mean, we could literally go back into the footage. We could. Just to confirm. I, bro, I'm gonna be honest, I'm two seconds away from running out this bitch. Yeah, <laughs> I'm never coming back. I'm about ready to do that too So Well, actually no, I'm staying here the night. You're staying here the night. Yeah. So what the hell did I just see? Yeah, I'm hearing- You saw that, right? I, I saw a woman literally like standing there. What? Sarah, is that you? Bro, this damn dress, that's the second time tonight. Yeah. I'm not even gonna lie, ever since the Hinsdale house, I, it's been nonstop, like I'm just seeing things. Like, people, everywhere. That's a little freaky. As soon as I said that, a cold ass gust of air just came right through. I'm gonna let you say one last thing. This is your time. Oh, my battery thing. Screw you, battery thing. Oh my God. What? Look what it said. Forest? Why is it spelt like that? I don't know. That's weird. Serve. Serve? Serve who? I mean, there were servants in this house. I knocked. I knocked. Whoa. You did indeed. You also slammed the door, made the rampod do some crazy shit. <laughs> Goodbye, I said. Perfect. Okay. Goodbye. <laughs> Thank you for communicating with us because holy shit, this has been one cra- Before, I keep in mind, we haven't even went upstairs yet. Mm. There's a whole third floor and an attic for us to explore. Yep. All right. Um, you know how rare that shit is for this to... Yeah. I'd let alone turn back on. <laughs> what the fuck? I mean, clearly it was in the on switch position, so. Yeah, bro, the only other it's not, way It's to not like a malfunction or anything. I have to rewatch that footage because yeah. I'm, I'm, I gotta see that. I don't know. I don't know, dude. All right, I, I need a break, bro. It seemed that whatever was affecting Chad is also now affecting me. This second floor is no joke. Whatever is here is powerful. And you know what? It was time for me to take a break. And I went outside, gathered myself up for a bit and decided to head up to the third floor and the attic. What you're about to watch is me being drained. Whatever is up there, it just destroyed me. Uh, you won't even recognize me by the end of the video and, and it's crazy. And I always just have to wonder, is it the spirits and entities here or is it what followed me here? What do you guys think? Take a look. All right guys. Uh... <laughs> Megan. Megan? As we're about to go up into the attic. Huh. Megan, you up there? Megan? Here we go. Holy shit, this is horrifying. Disowning. Disowning. Bro, this is probably one of the... Whoa. Look at all this poop on the stairs. Drown. Hmm. Megan, did you drown? Definitely. Oh! <gasps> Whoa. Definitely. Okay. Yo, I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm super lightheaded right now. Um, here, go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. I'm just gonna take a second. Oh, oh man. It's it just said man. Sounds like ass up here. Like raccoon ass. It's probably, there's some sort of animals up here for sure. For sure. Hello, Mr. Raccoon? 
I think I just, I just heard something up here. Wait, listen, listen. I just heard knocking. Oh, I heard that too. It said man last. Who is this man? Does he have a name? You are lost. You are lost. Well, not quite, but... Is there anybody up here with us? Bro, it sounds like someone's... A dozen. A dozen? A dozen? Marked. Marked. Are you gonna mark one of us? Coroner. Over there. Oh, just heard another thing over here. Everything. We're so, a lot going on up here. There is no electricity being run up here. No. So there, there's nothing. I'm free. I'm free. Who are you? Are we still speaking to Megan? You've been quiet after you said find me. Can you give us a hint? Andrea, huh? Good. I'm not feeling good up here. Bro, can we go downstairs? I'm not feeling good up here. I'll mm -hmm. be honest. I'm sorry to cut this attic thing short, guys, but I, I, I'm just not feeling good. Horrible. horrible. <laughs> yeah, I'm horrible. feeling pretty fucking horrible. <laughs> Thanks for acknowledging. Um, we really didn't cover too much on the third floor, so I just need some, like... I will... You lose. You lose. If you leave, you lose. He wants I us to guess. Here. Are, are we taking the L or what? Bro, I'm going to be honest. I'm not feeling good. Mm -hmm. I feel like if I do stay here longer, I probably, like, it was, it's, it mentioned scratched earlier. It mentioned Mark and stuff like that. And I really don't want to play with Stephanie Corpse. Stephanie Corpse. Stephanie Corpse. Shit. I hate you. I hate you. Feeling, you too. Feelings mutual. Yeah. Huh? Why is this guy such a dick? <laughs> <laughs> Bro, he hates me because I'm leaving. <laughs> Probably. He's like, this guy is no fun. <laughs> no. I wasn't up there for a long time. However, I was up there long enough to know that whatever is up there was draining the hell out of me. If you saw on numerous occasions, I was losing my footing. I was almost like swaying. My whole body was, I, I just felt so weak but i tried to push through because i really wanted to get a good video out for you guys and it eventually took its toll on me and you're about to see that right here all right guys so group of us group of us as there's a group of us up here too so this is the third floor there's a lot of haunted items what oh what the fuck it's fucking rocking bro Killer. Killer. That, remember what Andy, the owner, told us? Yeah. That, that's a very haunted rocking item, a ch children's item, mm -hmm. and it rarely ever moves. So there's a haunted carriage up here. That, there's a haunted, like, thing that transports bodies, and it's been used hundreds of times. So, very freaky things up here. Conjure. Oh. Conjure. Charity. Charity. Who moved this? Rocking horse. Bro, look at this. This item claims to have seen the previous owners of this item. Standing beside you. Whoa. Okay. It says the previous owners of this item claim to have seen it rocking on its own many times. Oh, wow. As we just saw. It rocking. Look at it giving us the side eye. <laughs> okay. 
The thing is, there's so many things up here that have been purchased from like estate sales yeah. and uh, antique shops that like it literally is just. Now this thing is creepy. A very much so. Literally has like a tree branch at the top. I know, right? Is there anything attached to this chair right here? Can you let us know? I heard something coming from this room over here. This like open room. Who's in this room? Um, okay, I thought this, but bro, look in here. Frequency. Yeah. So, Anthony. Anthony, remember the story that he told us about this? Mm -hmm. He said that they, they, they got this, they purchased it, and they kept getting the name Emily on the spear box over and over again. And they, they never really, like paid any mind. There's like, all right, Emily, whatever, bro. He said that they found the name Emily on the top of this baby carriage. Yeah, Emily. Yep. Upset me. Upset me. Three spirits. Three spirit. Wait. Did anybody else hear that? Yep. Loud and clear. Loud and clear. So it was like three like knocks or. Bangs or something all the way down there. Oh my God! What? Angelo! Holy Guys, look at this! Of... Johnson. Look at that thing. Whoa, is it alive? I don't know. Go give it a kiss. Oh, that's alive. All right, I'm... Even a kiss? <laughs> I don't know. It's gigantic. No, it's not even moving. What, what kind of spider is that? Do you guys know? I have no idea. Probably a wolf spider. Those, the wolf spider's a little jumpy. She looks prego. That's not cool to judge somebody based on Angela Cole. Oh, I'm just saying. That's not cool. Hey, pregnancy is pregnancy. Tunnel. Where is this? Uh... Was that you, Chad? What? I keep thinking I... It sounded like that damn carriage moved behind him. Why, oh, stop. Bro, I'm hearing so much shit right now. Something's flying around in here now. Oh, hell no. I know they got bats. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's for sure. Take me. Take me. Abstractedly. Abstractedly. Look at this wallpaper. Yeah, it's crazy. There it is. See my shadow. Whoa. Where? Show yourself. In which direction? Are you attached to this? More creepy dolls. So this has been used, he said, about a hundred times, if not more than a hundred, to, to transport bodies. Mm -hmm. It's not used as certain. It's not used as the actual yeah, it's for transportation purposes. Curious, is there any spirit attached to this right here? Sounds like footsteps. Yeah. Earlier I said, see my shadow. Do you want to show yourself to us? Oddly quiet right now. We are still here. <laughs> <laughs> I said it's oddly quiet. We're still here. <laughs> All right, that's fine. Thank you for l letting me know that. Can you uh, let us know some more information about the spirit attached to this? Or spirits? You said there's three spirits here. I would like to know some of your names. You think there's anything attached to those dolls over there? Is anybody else hearing footsteps? I, uh, yeah. It's coming from there. Yeah, yeah. Yep, it's right there. Okay. I'm assuming they want us to... It's almost like a follow me kind of game. Yeah. Alrighty. We're coming. Hear me. What did that say? Hear me. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, we hear you all right. Andy said there was... 
so it might, might be playing like hide and seek. Yeah, his name's uh, Elliot. Elliot. Yeah, yeah, those are his toys over there. Yeah. His favorite is uh, the elf. Yeah. There's an there's another spirit who apparently takes care of all the littler spirits. Oh, that's nice. That's yeah. really sweet. Listen. Children are playing. Wow. <laughs> no wow. Doubt. Playing hide and seek. Yep. All right, we'll come find you. Died in fire. Died in fire. Wow. Holy shit. Two spirits. We went from three to two. Hmm. Where did the other one go? It sounded disappointed too. Yeah. Two spirits. Find the light. Two Find spirits. The light. Oh God, this place looks creepy as all hell. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I guess it's time to do a little sp Voices. Okay, stand still. Voices. Let me know if you guys hear anything. Evil. There's literally footsteps. Yeah, I know. From right behind you, hold on. It's like literally from back here. Planned. It is August. Congratulations, you got that right. Okay. Um. What the hell did you hear that? Stay here. Okay. We will. No problem at all. But there's so many sounds right I now. I know. How many spirits are here with us right now? What is that that I hear in the hallway back there? Right behind that door? Or who is that that I hear? You said that children are here. Why don't you come have a seat with your... Whoa. Bro, that sounded like something just sat on the... Yo, this moved. Let people know. This moved, I saw it. What the? This, it was like, it just moved up and down like that. Oh yeah? Bro, it sounded like something just sat on the springs. Yeah, like I know. A... I know, I heard that. Oh my god. Do you have a name? Who is here with us? Thank you, actually. Thank you so much. It's the 1980s. 1980s. Bro, I'm gonna be honest. I am getting... Like, I'm not feeling good. Maybe we should, uh... I mean, we're getting close to, what, 4 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. I, mean, I could just be drained and tired. Oh, it's my arthritis. You, earlier, you said evil. Is this evil entity still here? Do you want to hurt us? Yes or no? Breathe. 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 I'm trying. It's hard, kind of hard to breathe up here, I'll be honest. <sighs> I'm trying to hold myself together. I literally feel like I'm going to fall over anytime. Busy. Busy. Okay. Is the spirit here? 
Oh, I need to sit down. I do not feel good. Holy fuck. It feels really hot up here all of a sudden. Like I'm actually it, sweating. Yeah, it was actually cold. Now mm -hmm. it's getting like really warm. Usually they say when a spear enters a room, it's cold, but mm -hmm. I don't know why it's getting all hot. Mm. Okay. What the fuck was that? Okay. Listen, something in here is making me feel... Something in here is making me feel weak. Are you affecting me? Is there something in here affecting me, making me feel weak? What the f Where'd that come from? Bro! That was loud as f So. Holy f Bro, I think it was this door right here. Which one? Haunted doll. Friend. Did I say haunted doll? Yeah. This doesn't make sense. There's nothing in this room. Overdose. I don't know. Listen, guys, I, I'm done. I'm done. I, I, I can't do this anymore. I'm done. I'm done. Grave. I'm done. Well, shit. Guys, uh... I'm sorry, but that's it for the footage that I recorded this night. And I'm sorry because I know that you expect me to stay the full night and I know you hate when the videos end like this, but I'm sorry. I wasn't staying another minute inside of this place. I felt so drained and I felt, I just didn't feel like myself by the end of the night. And at this point I was like, I'm packing my bags. I'm getting the hell up out of here. And that's what I did. The scary thing of it all is not knowing whether or not the entities are from the castle itself, the land, the forest, or is it what's been following Angelo and I. And truth be told, ever since I've been home from this house, I still feel uneasy. I feel as if there may be something here. And that's the scariest part of all, right? Because if something is following me and I'm going to a haunted location after haunted location and it's just feeding off this energy and feeding and draining me and I don't know, right? However, this was my stay here at the Haunted Castle in Vermont. One of the most active locations I have ever been to. I'm gonna be honest, I wanna go back and Ben wants to come next time. So if you guys do want us to go back for a part two, make sure to smash that like button. If this video reaches 22,000 likes, you have my word, Ben and I will travel to this castle again, spend the full night, or at least try to, and see what happens that time. So if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and also subscribe to the channel if you have not already. But above all else, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next Paranormal Investigation. Peace.